Hello everyone. I guess everyone was hoping that Grassroot Football will be back. This is Molanga Grassroot Football Show. The host still is David Samgete, the sports guru of Impumalanga, Umsusu El Tutuva. Angna El Tutuva, Ganga Ogre Sizi, Matim Sikpeda, Lenema Tutuva. Week 5 has came and gone. Uh, Lago APC Motsepelik, Sponi, the little village Suagulo, Sponi, a total of 25 goals that has been scored. The Aves in Kumbula, Ave Nai Show, Sifi, Saguti, Pinze Ibuya. It took Niga Lugendega Gumpumalanga Grassroots Football Show. Last season, we made a total of 11 episodes. That was big for our first time uh, season in Go Grassroots Football Show. Thanks for all the support that you did give to each show. Sibui Legemanji, Yad Gusikle season there, we'll have a lot to offer. We'll do some interviews with the chairmen, we'll do interviews with players who are outstanding on their teams in the division. We'll do interviews uh, with everyone who's involved with the beautiful game. We have to bring everything closer to you right on this channel so you can know what is happening on APC Motsepelik here in Mpumalanga. Teams like Pachin FC, uh, they are still they are setting the trend. We have Mpumalanga Football Academy, that we're known as Football Academy. We have the teams like Ganyamas and the All Stars, we have Feni Battalions. Uh, we can name them. We're expecting a lot from all the teams, all the 16 teams that are on this division. But before we go further, let's just uh, quickly check uh, the the new teams that has just uh, joined APC Motsepeli. We're talking about the Flamingo that is coming all the way from Omkondo. And then we have uh, Sibange Young Parks that is also coming down uh, from Enkomas. We have a new team, a new name. You remember, Tier Sporting was relegated last season. So we have now this Gapogweni, uh, Gapogweni uh, Future Stars that they are now using the status of uh, uh, Tier Sporting here in APC Motsepeli. Let's quickly. Uh, check what uh, transpired when Sibange, Young Parks and Flamingo come to join uh, this division. I guess Chichi will take us through to these two teams or three teams rather, rather say. We're looking at Flamingo that are currently not doing very well and they are still looking in for their first win in four games. Only managed to score about one and considered seven. Not looking good at all there David. But then again let's move right along. <laughs> Uh, but uh, the team is new to the league. Uh, some players like the APC in the league, like Softeco, Bokalas, and Bomlu. Uh, remember, we say we find a lot of people in the league now. So I guess I guess last year, Bafana, 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 right, Bafana, we say we use by the hands of the team. Now we go on, we go on, we go on, we mail, we go on, we fight, and now we go on, we go on, we go on, we go on, we fight. So I guess last year, Bafana, so Bafana, we go on, 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 we go Sibanga Young Blacks that has a team also that has played about four games with four points and they have one win against Flamingo, scored only three and considered five goals and now they are also looking to go back to the APC Motipe at uh, Gapogwen Stadium. In fact, it's a game that played at Gapogwen Stadium. Seemingly, there will be more of these stories coming up. Now, let's go back to you, Mtava. Yeah, thank you, Chichi. Uh, I guess this is what is happening. Uh, Coach uh, Deliver, as we know him uh, by that name, Deliver, is the one that has promoted this bang Young Parks still with the team. They're not doing that good. Uh, um, I, I think the results are not coming as they wish uh, it can be. They have been joined by um, uh, Mr. Professor. We know him as an assistant coach of FC Civil. So he's, I think on this coming week, he'll be only his third game uh, still uh, under uh, Sibanga Young Parks, helping there as an assistant coach. Uh, let's quickly check uh, the Merry go round of the coaches. You know, coaches have been going uh, in and out in this um, APC Motsepelik division here in Pumalanga. From match day one, we saw a coach leaving. Match day two, match day three, match day four. Uh, even on match day five, uh, one team uh, that is using the very same pitch that we are shooting is also uh, have a new coach. They dismissed or they've changed. I don't know what they call it. It's a technical director. Ah, we have to hear from them uh, what, they, what is the meaning of technical director. 
director maybe if we get a chance to speak to them but yeah they, they have a new coach now let's quickly do the coaching and see who's in who's out we have a checklist strongly that he headed in Sivuta stars he has parted ways with the club after just playing two games sunny boy Mdagwende is another coach of Mlambo Royal Cubs that has left the club after only three games patient of C Oswega uh, a other team that have also parted ways with the coach Tape Liao after only playing four games. Then we have Ganyamazane All Stars, uh, Mandla Mataba. The only difference here is shifted positions from being a coach to being CEO at the club just after four games. And then lastly, we have Bakwena Chiefs man uh, Vusim Kajwa has resigned or resigned for him on him for himself and as a coach after playing two games. Well. It is indeed a very heavy one when it comes to this, David. And firstly forward, so uh, some of these teams are needs to adjust to the new changes and hoping that things get better. And we do wish them all the best continuing forward with the season. Let me take it back to you, Dava. Yeah, uh, coaches are coming and going. Uh, it's tough on this uh, that division, it's tough in this province where the chairmen are looking for nothing but good results in each and every game. We see that the coaches are coming, coaches are leaving. Tapelo Liao at uh, Pashin FC was promising that he was going to do things good for that team, but unfortunately the results didn't uh Come as he wished. That is why we see now this James Emma a former Plumfontein Celtics player. Uh, he did make uh, very well to the teams that he was coaching before. He was in the suit at some point uh, where he did uh, very well. He's coming back now in Pumalanga to APC Motsepe League. As we see, we saw that Tapelo Liao is no longer there. He's joined by a former coach as well. Uh, Cosmo, uh, Mr. Tabang and Love is coming on this one as an assistant coach. So it's going to be a good thing uh, to combine in this team and hopefully they will bring results for Ipashin FC. I'm sitting on a bench where Pensil Mthong will be sitting because we already know uh, that is coming uh, for that uh, in this team we'll hear later uh, from the chairman who employed the gentleman to come back and help Gajamas and All-Stars to compete in this division. This is the bench that he's going to use. Uh, just to take you down memory lane, first time he coming to this bench to coach um, Bombela City Lads, uh, he came uh, here, I think it was on, on a Wednesday, Thursday. First game of him was on this pitch versus uh, uh, FC Sivuta NPC and then he was uh, humiliated with five uh, to nil goals. It was a big, big, big um, a defeat uh, for him as a coach so far. And then this time around, he's coming back to join Ganyamas and the uh, All-Stars. Guess what? He's facing FC Sivuta NPC again, but this time down at Kamtucha Stadium on this coming Saturday. Let's quickly hear the results for the past week. How did it go? We have uh, Pumlan Mklang was going to take us through. I mang ebe melulu la game bela sonvo la isbuya guye milo lele ya APC Motsipeli eke kwati se kuse matrembo solo ya Shayan. Ustrim A. I will pay a part. I could guess why is in my FCC for the NP and I'll go line. He can say in. I say who name stars. I could guess why I'm not saying. No, I could guess why I'm not saying. All stars. I'm not going to let my belly go football academy. I could guess why if any pantalons. I'm not going to let my belly go line. I'm a clever United. I could guess why it banks it lands. I'm not going to let my belly can say. Who stream be in a corner? Did you get a banjo? No, what is the problem? Who's the player? Who's the player? We're not going to get it. We're not going to get it. We're not going to get it. Well, Cubs, I'm going to go to the future stars. I'm going to go to the Destiny FC. I'm going to go to the Papama FC. I'm going to go to the Hebrew Classic. I'm going to go to the Young Bucks. I'm going to go Flamingo. I'm going to go Flamingo. I'm going to go to the Flamingo. Thank you, Don. Thank you for the results. I, I think my teams are hitting left, right, and center. It was a total of 25 goals that has been scored this past weekend. Teams are gearing up. They started the season very slow. I remember the, the first uh, match day, they scored only 11 goals. It was a low uh, compared to last season's first match day because last season they've scored a total of 27 goals. This time around, it was 11 goals. But you can see teams are picking up now. Teams are scoring a left, right, and center. We saw Testini is smashing Kapogo in the future stars with five goals. So it was a big score on that one. Uh, thank you, Don. We'll uh, come again uh, with uh, the feature that is coming. But at the moment, I'm sitting with the new chairman 
of Ghana Mazane All Stars. They, 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 they've started before the season start to restructure the team. Uh, now they have a president, which is Mr. Uh, Kozam Simpiwe. We're sitting with the new chairman of Ghana Mazane All Stars here, Mr. Mpendulo Mkabela. How are you, sir? Okay, invite by Mujan. No, I got Pilega, I got Pilega. No, number one. New chairman of Ghana Mazane All Stars. Is that correct? It's correct, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Mkaben, can you just take us uh, uh, through or briefly? Why did you join the team? Uh, I joined the team because I wanted to have a strong team uh, to combine two teams. Mm. You remember, if you remember, well, there were rumors circulating that the other team, Kanyamazane. So we've decided, you know, Mr. Koza, the sitting president of the yes. club, would see. Let's join forces and make this thing to be very much bombastic. Yeah. In terms of resources of the players and and, and, and everything. Yeah, that's the purpose of joining Ganyamaza Nostas. Oh, the team have uh, already four games since you've joined. You were with them uh, during the preseason, the preparations and everything. So they've played four games so far. Were you happy with the performance? <laughs> <laughs> to be quite honest, no, no, no. We're expecting better results because if you check, we've played four games. We lost all our away games. We had two away games. We lost yeah. uh, again Futsi, Sawi Naikai, our two games. Yeah. So we're hoping Futsi by now at least we'll be sitting comfortably, maybe 12 points. Because I know our team is very strong. These players are capable of delivering on the pitch. Yes, you started the season with um, head coach Mr. Mandla Mataba uh, with two assistant coaches, Rizin Chilwane and Sandy Limdawe as the, his assistants, two gentlemen. So this past weekend, you just made some changes. You decided to give him a role, another role, which is, um, I hear, is a technical director, is that correct? He's the CEO of the club. Oh, he's the CEO of the club. Yes. So you move him from the bench to the office. Yes. Who are, who are you bringing? Yeah, we're bringing a uh, coach, Benson Mklong, yes. uh, I think everyone is familiar with. Uh, why Benson? Why Benson? Um, if I can take you back, uh, Sam Gete, uh, uh, the reason why we changed Mr. Mataba is not that he was not playing well. Yeah. Uh, you could see that the team was playing, but then Mr. Mataba is full-time employed at a certain department. Yes. So sometimes my training is a loser. Can you want a full time coach yes. that will be full time? I train in a Bafana on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. That's the reason why when we checked uh, availability of Benson, Sabona Gutsuto Konak Bakona full time. Yeah. We brought him here and then we decided because we still need Mr. Machaba in the team to give him a new role in, 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 our, in, our, in our management. Okay, this, this division, you're not maintaining position, not maintaining the status and all the stuff, but on this division, there's one purpose to compete and promote the team uh is pencil himself been given that mandate uh, did he took the job because he know that he can achieve that definitely uh, uh, when he agreed to join Hagemans and stars he knows the mandate yeah. he needs to come and deliver and i believe in him will give him the support uh, already you've lost uh, six points uh, 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 is it still there? Yeah. Uh, uh, some day. So what we need to do is just to be consistent with our win. Uh, we have the team. Yes. The team can deliver. Uh, so yeah, we hope we could see we toss nigga lesik funago and now I know we could see we coach us a win. Yeah. With his experience, we are we a win. You know, when it came to Ganyamazane last time, when Bobila City was still, it was still um, around APC Motsipedic, his first game was against the Sivota NPC, and he lost on that game. Now he's coming again uh, to Ganyamazane All-Stars to face the very same opponent. <laughs> what is your take on that? <laughs> <laughs> different setup, yeah. different club will come up victorious. Different players. Different players. Still a nice vote. Okay, what can be the message from you to the supporters of Ranyamas and the All-Stars from this day going forward? Uh, it is to say uh, 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 not all is lost. Yeah. Yes, we have messed up our way uh, on two occasions. Yes. But we promised the fans that um, uh, uh, we've ratified our mistakes 
I think the boys they wanted a full time coach, yeah. someone that will be there to train them on a daily basis. That will be very much closer. Not that Mandela was not doing it. Dr. Mataba was doing that, but yeah. at the same time he was employed. Uh, he's employed somewhere else, of which is understandable uh, for a person to be employed somewhere else because yeah. he must provide for his or his, his own family. So. To the fans who are still there, yeah. just come out in numbers and support the boys. Uh, they need our support. We'll definitely be number one. Uh, some I'm telling you, we'll be number one. Going for number one. We are going for number one. So, Fini Patalios is just holding the umbrella up there. They're a good team, but yeah. we are there to challenge them. Ah, okay, that's fair enough. That's the chairman of Ganyamazan All Stars, Mr. Mpendulo Mukavela, taking us through with the, with the new appointment that he did and the movement in the team where Dr. Mandla Mataba has been moved from the bench to the office, just like he said. He's now a CEO of the team. They have Benson Mshongo. Everyone knows the legend. He's now coming to be the gaffer of the team. Don, quickly take us through to the picture of this coming weekend. We know uh, Ganyamas and All Stars is going down Gamtlu, which are destiny. They're still playing Gapogon Stadium even this uh, this week, facing Papama. Take us through. Week six. I have a team in the second AM Stars, the Amsterdam Environmental Center. The FC's votes are NPC, Vagashela, Ganyamazan, All Stars, Gamshusha Stadium. It would be in City Lights, if I eat Vagashela, Nama Vagashela, in Pumaranga Football Academy, Ellenville Stadium. A passion FC, if Vagashela would be in Shepard, the Academy Hockey Ground. Gustrim B, Nakonage, Nama Destiny, is all we have by MB, Logulog, Kela Brango Strim B, a Hebron Classic, if Vagashela, in Bakuena, achieves a Solomon. If Flamingo United, if Vagashelwa, Umlamo Royals Cubs, Eman Lama Kutura Stadium, if Destiny FC, you have learned a Papa Ma FC, the Bogor Stadium. But you know, stars, you know, I see you have Vagashelwa, you see Bang, a young Pax, and Jindin Stadium. Thank you, Don, for a feature. Uh, that's the games that you're going to see this coming weekend. It looks so tense and it's very, very uh, challenging and exciting to see the teams facing each other uh, like that. We you know Stream A, we have a Fendi Patalions. We have to see how far they can keep that position. On Stream B, we have the Destiny FC. That's also the team that is coming okay. They started uh, their season very low, winning 1-0, 1-0 board games so now they are sitting on the summit of the log uh, that's what we have uh, this uh, on this episode so to say on this episode episode first episode actually uh, or for match day five uh, going forward Pumalanga uh, football uh, is exciting we have um, Pumalanga grassroots football show that is back in full swing we still have to give you profiles of the players we still have to give you a coming from the teams and everyone who's involved with the beautiful game. Ning Samgate, Nitsi Logum Shop, me and you, as one and eating good journey, or else, let's see the next episode that is coming. It's a pie.